Hello there, and welcome back to Let's Play Space Rangers to Reboot. Yeah, I'm back in the scientific base called Time, and pardon my pun, but it's been some time since I last recorded this. Never mind the fact that I had absence of two months, took a hiatus from this LP series, so I obviously forgot some things about uh, what worked and what didn't work, uh, mostly what worked, such as not enabling the mouse cursor in the last batch of episodes. I hope I enabled it. Again, yeah, as you can see around this guy's face. I hope you didn't mind, but I kind of felt that it helped me edit the videos a bit better because this little spinning thing is not around anymore to keep track of, but this is the full experience of Space Rangers 2 that hopefully the viewers will be able to appreciate this uh, beautiful mouse cursor. Anyways, yeah, I'm back in time. Space, uh, scientific base, that is. A capella. And I think... Oh yes, this music's great. Very soothing. I think I had left certain probe somewhere. Oh, okay. So there is two. I'm just doing nothing. An idol. At Denebo and Pollux. Yeah, the planet Hardcore. Hmm, I wonder what Hardcore will hold for me. And let's see. Pollux. Oh, it's okay, just below so I can probably pick this up. I guess that's what I'm going to do next. Just pick up the probes and see what I have found. Hopefully I found some nice nice micro modules or two. Let's go from there, why don't we? So looking at the equipment here, and then the state of the galaxy, still yeah, still some dominant sectors about, but not now belong to the good alliance races of the galaxy. So that's all good, progressing pretty nicely. And yeah, still need to, you know, get my act together. Let's go and try to get the probe. All right. Yeah, so I cannot really get over still how big this hall is. It's pretty nice. Although I forgot to check. Uh, I forgot to check the current. Oh, okay, wow. All right. Hailing from the pirate at the same time as I got hit by an asteroid that this guy will laugh in my face for being hit by it. Instead, this, yeah, mistaken identity time once again as I basically have to play a bit of a sheriff here. Um, yeah, I know that this guy is in danger, this um, Feyan transport. So let's end the connection and being a good guy that we are, let's try to hail him again. Let's see if I can talk to him out of it. How much did you pay for the ranger certificate? You really think it will help you earn more? Well, it did help me a lot, and you can still be a pirate with a ranger license. Although you're going to get a black heart mark you cannot get rid of. You can actually offer him to join my crew, but yeah, no. Alright, so this guy gave up attacking the... Oh wow, the transport is actually trying to attack the pirate. He's on his own business. Oh, that's pretty funny. Oh, he was trying to get the mineral. Anyways, yeah, I'm going to pick up my probe. This guy is trying to... Oh, I don't know. They exist pretty peacefully there. So good. And I need to go to Shun. Alright, thinking of the possibilities of Pun, but I will not go there. Yeah, a lot of interesting names in this Malok system, and this is... yeah. Okay, in the nick of time, the transport was able to get away. Nice. So, what do we have here? Let's see. Ooh, okay, that's pretty cool. A micro module called Forcer. Third level micro module is installed in the housing. Activates the scanner, radar, and afterburner slot. Could be pretty useful in the Mio Plus Medic Class 3 halls. Yeah, I mean, it's okay. I can probably exchange it for a few nodes at Ranger Center. Right. Yeah, I need to probably organize this to type. That's better. Yeah, I was thinking about the configuration. And there is different options that you can choose here, which gives you a different configuration on the fly. So I will do that. Um, Divided by the role that I'm going to play between battles and just your normal day-to-day, -day, um, yeah, normal day-to-day -day business as a ranger traveling to systems and whatnot. 
for battle, uh, which I'm going to be, yeah, I guess the default, you know, just choose number one. I'm going to have all the, I don't know, I haven't tried this before, but yeah, let me just do this if it works, even with the artifact. And this seems to be, yeah, I need to also have the, the mere plasmatic engine. So is it all filled up? Yeah. Let me just fill this thing up first, no? Oh, I already have all the fuel I need. Alright, so this is going to be the first furnishing, and the second one... Yeah, it does work with the artifact as well, which is pretty good. Yeah, so I took this artifact off. Black dog should be inside at all times. And the same goes for matter side accelerator and also nanotoids. And uh, yeah, tempo engine is going to be in place for faster flying. That's good. Alright, so that's not a really good haul. I'm gonna make do with what I have and go to Denable. Yeah, let's go to Denable. And have I chosen my. Yeah, number two. Number one, number two. So number two is also going to be helpful when I have to, you know, just get out of the dodge, accelerate out of the system to save myself from the dominators. Okay, so a little bit of talk here. It's good to have chat every once in a while. Okay, so we are at Megrez and this is military base. Let's go there and see what's up. How many more dominators I have to destroy in order to get the last rank up. Um, yeah, okay, so a lot of pirates about in this world. This guy is out of control. Oh, this guy's running away anyways. Alright, so greetings my luck, you've already become one of the most famous individuals. Hmm, doesn't seem like it. I think people are kind of avoiding me. Uh, what after I converted my face or I changed my face to my luck, they were more, I guess, more receptive to talking with the ranger, but... Not anymore, it seems. They're just going about their business now that peace has returned to most of the galaxy. Okay, so we have a uh, yeah, multi-resonator. Pretty cool stuff. Yeah, all these grippers. Look at that, 500 units. Very expensive and does look it, definitely. And Mioplasmic Housing 3. Yeah, impressive. 13 hit points, definitely better. Okay, so let's... You know, I'm just wondering whether... I have enough money now. I'm kind of wondering if I can just fill my weapon slot up with multi-resonators. Because I think I'll be able to do that without losing out too much out of range. Um, and I do have the space necessary to be able to accommodate as such. Yeah, we have a couple of pretty good multi-resonator options at um, Eldegore and Migres, which is this system. Yeah, 40 is pretty decent, although there is one better at Hemni, which is also close by. Yeah, I want to have a cheap one if it's possible. 37, Procyon. Okay, well I guess I come into it, run into it as I travel the galaxy. But I can buy one here at Seisha. Shisha. Yeah, so let's go there and buy it. Trick our trick our hall with the best weapons that we can bring. Yeah, okay. When I'm going to be promoted to Commodore, you must get 870 military pilot points. So yeah, I have a, still a ways to go. And I also want to order a military operation. Yeah, let's see if I can actually fit in my uh, multi-resonator, well, I mean, my shopping for multi-resonator between ordering the operation and actually heading to one of the dominator systems. So military operation is a serious expensive secret matter. We accept orders for military operation organization from our client for the following conditions. So 100% payment, which is you have to pay this amount of money, 100%. And I think if it doesn't go, no, actually you have to pay this amount, 28,600, which is a substantial amount. And you know, they're not kidding around when they're saying that it's expensive endeavor. and. If the military operation doesn't go through, they get to keep this, I guess, comparably um, small amount of payment that you have made uh, as part of that, you know, the ministry of cost or something, or their long distance call cost. So yeah, I'm very serious about it. Let's try it. 
Uh, unfortunately, even the best expert of our operating department could not assemble a suitable strike force. Well, you guys, you guys are just playing with me. 30 to 70. Yeah, credits lost. But, uh, now I can probably try next time. I really want to order a military operation to take back one of the systems. And Gragar is... Yeah, they are trying to take over Gragar um, to the best of their ability, but... Yeah, it's not going to... It's not going to be taken over anytime soon with their piecemeal attacks. The Rangers are attempting. Um, I can order it right now again, I think, right? Yeah, but you gotta pay up the same amount of money, so... Let's just leave it. Yeah, Sasha, this is where the um, multi raison nether is. Blue sun. You know, it doesn't have blue color here, but... Anyways... Oh, this one? No, this one? Ah, it's this one. 24 to 61. Um, seems to be pretty special. Because it has a green mark on it. Maybe someone sold it. Let's buy it. Yeah, let's buy this. And, um, and number one is the default. Let's put it here. So we'll be ready. And the Dominator comes. Two is just more of a... I mean, if there's like a hyperspace, I'll be more akin to using number two setup instead of number one. I'm a variety in the weapons, and I do like the star projectiles that it should chop. The flow blaster should chop. Yep, okay. And apparently, um, yeah, Bars, the viewer that has frequented this LP series, and has thankfully informed me you can actually communicate with the planet using the dialogue options the space screen so I tried it I think that helps me with the trade and whatnot um, yeah so well, minerals are pretty good price so I just buy it no loss there yeah the minerals are there all nice so where to um, I'm not so sure but let's try to talk talk impossible hmm. or maybe I read it wrong hmm. Okay. Oh, okay. Can I even shoot at the planet? Right, right, okay. Uh, let's go to Formagout. Or where it was hardcore? Oh, Denival. Okay, let's go to Denival. Yes. Try it. Yeah, and then see what the planet hardcore has storing for us. Okay, some hardcore probing that went there. Well, it's not complete. Probing, so I can probably drop another probe uh, just to be complete. Yeah, all right, let's go. Okay, Sarsimus. Yeah, there are some other planets I can probe. Neospin. All right, these guys are fighting. Nope, they're just pirate partners in crime. Yes, yes, let's see. Okay, okay, that's pretty disappointing. Well, at least we got something out of it. Yep. Anywho, yeah, I just not bother not even searching it. Let's just drop it. Drop one right here. Um, maybe I should drop it like a former god. Yeah, I don't know. Is there any other military base around? Ethnic base, business sector. There is one at, yeah, Aldagor. No, Megaraz one is the closest one. Okay, there's Pirate Base. Yeah. Okay. Let's go to Former God, and I guess we can jump into Gragar and see what's happening. And if I'm lucky, we can get another Merkin Resonator to prepare ourselves for the battle. Um, really want to try the military operation though. Wow, these guys are just... This buzz of activity is some nice lucrative trade route in and out of the system, perhaps. Uh, Beta Ionis, Xanland, yeah. Okay, so it has no water. Hmm. Okay, so it's going somewhere. Avior, hmm. I wonder what is in Avior. Okay, I can check it. Oh, this is perfect. Yeah, this is perfect. 
Alright. What is happening at Aviora? Well, doesn't seem to be anything um, serious. Yeah, alright. Let's go to one of the systems here and then sell the minerals. Yep, they can provide me with some, you know, nice change. Alright. Okay, so the food stuff is good price and I just dumped this. Yeah, why not? Luxuries are not too bad. Uh, I mean, let's check the luxury prices. 678. Yeah, it's not bad or anything. It's not great either. Let's see what they have here. Wow, nice weapons. But they're just too heavy. Yeah, even too heavy for my 900 plus haul. Let's see, multi resonator. Another one. 42. There's one at Murgas. Okay. Yeah, pretty decent one at 42 hull space. There's one at Rasta Baggin. It's pretty expensive though. 36. Yeah, is it really worth it? I mean, basically, I have a lot of space, so let's just try to get this at Arctur. Get here? Okay. Alright, let's make a stop there. There's a lot of cheddar here. Yeah. Pirate activity. Doctor. Go there. Getting that multi resonator is going to help me, I think. I mean, missiles are. and full blaster are definitely pretty cool. Um, especially with their range, but. now I can make the most out of the hull by using the multi resonator. Okay, so there's only one fan planet, which is this one. I think this is where the my weapon of choice has been sold, and the pirates are battling themselves. Interesting. Yep, yeah, so we can check what that pirate told it. Uh, Marcusha Gava. Yeah, he has some pretty great stuff. A lot of universe. Wow, a lot of first level micro modules, but he does have a bit of a illness. Substance addiction, yeah, okay, no surprise. Legion of Death Hall, very powerful ones, very powerful. The pirates could probably lend a hand in uh, taking back the systems. Support you to this one, yes. Yeah, hopefully I'm making a, hopefully I'm not wasting money here. I think it's going to help, definitely. Yeah, this one. Yeah, I mean, I want to get more uh, modules, I guess, especially to beef up the hull. Um, I think only only one is able to do it, which is called Universe. Uh, Strongster is well, only for human and pelling hulls. And then, um, what else? What do you have? Can I scan you? Oh no, yeah, scan capacity inefficient. Yeah, this guy was just wiping the floor with the other guy that was heavily armed with like water resonators and disintegrators and whatnot. So this guy must have some very great stuff. But you can see that this guy, yeah, carrying a lot of weapons because the speed, typical speed for pirate now uh, exceeds around 900. And only the heavy weapons will drag it down to around 741, so very impressive and 39% defense. Yeah, they're not kidding around. Let's go to Gorgar and see if we can get some nodes and the weapons and the like. They're still fighting, right? Yeah, they're still fighting. Yeah, you can see all that weapon does not do any damage against this guy. Very impressive. Right, a lot of stuff. Uh, mostly uh, cisterns. <laughs> But some of it is hidden. Oh, wow, I could use this. But I think somebody already get it. Yeah, somebody already had this on it. Okay. I think the rangers um, like this particular space because there's only one dominated planet that is manufacturing the ships. And in Gradar, the Terran, excuse me, while he's hostile and he can lob like missiles of death and doom. Um, I mean, you can get away from him, he's not that 
I mean, he has like, a lot of speed, but he's not that fast. You can run away from him and then, you know, try to target this guy in mass. You probably just want to try out what is happening. Oh, he's following me now. I wonder if he can... Um, all these missiles are now aiming at me, probably. Check. Yes, yes. Yeah, it's all aiming at me, that bastard. Yeah, but I'm gonna try this now. All multi resonator setup. See, 120. Mm, not bad. 170 was the maximum. There's some nodes I can get. Well, these are. Wow, well, okay. Something that I can use. Especially for research. And I forgot once again. Oh, I didn't forget. Okay, that's good. I think I forgot to equip the artifact. The 3930. Yeah, yeah. Not, not good. Not good at all. Oh man, these guys are not giving up. I don't know why it stays so close. Yeah, that's not, that's not good. I need to stay away from this guy as fast as possible. Um, yeah, this guy doesn't seem to be attacking me, but he will soon target me, so I just, at my leisure, try to go there. Uh oh. Yeah. I'm trying to at least keep abreast of the damage rate right here. Yeah, it's pretty slow. I wonder how far the range for the Terran recognizing that my ship is being ranged, uh, making him shoot that horrific missile. There's another, oh, there's an Encrantor. There's a pretty big fish. And I cannot know, yeah, how much hit points she has. Maybe uh, time for a better scanner? I don't know. Yeah, I can get some of these. Um, I don't know whether it really matters though. I can get some good nodes here, at least. It's gonna help me with the... Yeah, okay, so let's keep attacking. And I guess this is a grind. Yeah, this is basically grinding. Um, not for levels per se, but for uh, nodes or some goods that you can mine. And there's my friend. Probably I recognize him. Yeah, Horohomag is ranger number two or three. Very high up there. And yeah, I don't know, he's faster than me though. Oh, that's pretty clean kill. And Terran is not really bothering me anymore. Yeah, he needs to revolve around the sun, thinking that he's a planet, so he cannot really... <laughs> yeah, he has to bide his time, wring his hands or something. Okay, oh, that looks pretty good too. Alright, let's get these two and be on my way. Still have 130 space. So I can... Okay, so, alright, so another appearance by the Blazers. And yeah, I can probably do the job for the Terran here, but I don't know why I should. They're the Dominators after all, so... Why not? Okay, so I think the Resonators doing a pretty good job, but it could do a bit better with the upgrades. Maybe if I have a lot of money, I could try to do that. And some of these things uh, I can sell for double the price. So that's cool. Yeah. How many do I do? Why do I have to worry about DPS in this kind of games? Wow, now this is a bonanza. Oh, I got destroyed though. Now that was not my missile, folks. I am not using the missile anymore, so you cannot blame me. I cannot blame myself for being a... Uh, wow, this is a huge invasion. I'm just going to sit and watch. Um, well, not too close, but yeah, I'm going to just see how well the Terran does. Let's see... Let's just try to focus on this guy. Yeah, he's getting hit, but not that much. Um, that's too close. I got hit a bit, but... Let's join the cause here. Why not? Okay. 
Wow, a lot of missile. Yeah, missiles definitely do help. Yeah, don't mind me. Yeah. Oh, they're all dead. My goodness. Yeah, that is very impressive. Very scary. But thanks, Terran, for uh, giving me all these nice parts. Definitely. And all these things. Wow. They're not kidding around with the nodes. A couple of Kentors got destroyed here. And alright, now you're targeting me. Okay, and oblige and kick your behind. Wow, alright. Who would ever thought that a Blazer and Malog is going to team up with each other? Stranger things have happened before. And these guys are not really trying to attack me. Oh, are they trying to attack me? Oh, okay, so that human ranger looked at this guy funny and... Yeah, don't mind me, I guess I lead these guys to them. Yeah. Okay, so, oh, okay, not a good choice. Because I cannot run away from him. So yeah, this is when the number two comes in. Although, I think I should get my... Um, my, uh, what is it, my rocket defense up. Yeah, they don't like me. I understand. Yeah, they are taking Terran now. Yeah, I mean, Terran is very, very hard to kill. That's true. But eventually, he's going to run out of the stuff. Now I need to yeah, put myself back into attacking mode and see what these guys can do. And also, get a bit of a shot in here. Yeah, a lot of, I mean, the blazers are just hell-bent on trying to kill these guys. And Terrans are just, yeah, Terrans just mauling them down. Oh, that's pretty scary. Yeah, don't mind me, Dominators, I am... Perhaps I have like, their camouflage, I think I have blazer camouflage that I purchased from the pirate base. So maybe, I mean, although they attack me sometimes, maybe that has kind of caused them to not really care or not really be sensitive toward the presence that much. I don't know whether that's true or not. Yeah, you guys will get that thing. No, he didn't get it. <laughs> yeah, this is basically just... Wow, yeah, three-way fight, which is just crazy. I wonder if the... Yeah, Blazer probably gave up now. Yeah, I can destroy them pretty well still, but... Oh, yeah, I have... Basically reached the limit here, okay. Ah, alright, so I made a pretty good... Um, I guess this is what you can call um, Dominator Run. Yeah, scientific base is just within my range, so that's good. So let me change it to 2. Look at all these Dominator parts. Let's see how much I can get. And you can see that the jump distance increased suddenly. All thanks to my faster engine, although it's not really that fast. But it's an extra engine that I can get a boost out of, so... I can still jump farther, some more options for escape. And after I um, dump my, all my stuff, I will upgrade one of my weapons and see um, if it helps any... Yeah. Alright, let's see. Paranoid department, yes, let's sell all this. Coordinator, I think that is blazers. So, this beta. Uh, that's right, yes, this one. Yep, okay, so I'm basically back to where I was. I think it's a good haul. Uh, stack barrel, tech detector, and all this other stuff. Yeah, I remember the tech detector, 31,000 uh, credit worth tech detector destroyed before I could get to it. But I could still, um, yeah, see, determine uh, what research needs more stuff. So yeah, twelve thousand days. Uh, I guess I contribute to Blazor. As you can see, this closer. Nose Terran. Yeah, with this and this nose, I will convert it to something that I can use to purchase a micro module along with this. Okay. All right. So. In the next episode, I will try to upgrade my weapons. 
and see uh, if I can further pressure uh, Terran or even um, take back Binatrix or all these fringe worlds occupied by Kettler by launching a military operation. Yeah, let me try once again. Um, first time it didn't work, second time might be the, the break that I needed to get all the systems back. Yeah, let's do that. So thank you once again for watching Space Rangers 2 Reboot LP and hope you can join me next time as well. Until then, please stay tuned.